As a private investigator, you take the cases you can get. It usually means long nights following scumbags to sleazy motels and taking photos too distasteful even for TMZ. Sometimes the scumbag runs. You have to chase him into the sewer where your socks get wetter than a deli sandwich that soaked up all the leaky pickle juice. Guess that's how I found myself on this crappy case. Standing in crap-filled water. Facing down a piece of crap criminal for a paycheck. It wouldn't be worth crap to a crap. If you think that sounds like too much crap, imagine how I feel. I didn't kill my wife! I don't care! Then why are you doing this to me? Maybe I just don't like your ugly face. Ugly? Well, ugly to me. I realize it's subjective and someone else might find you incredibly attractive, but you did ask why I'm doing this. Besides, I know your wife isn't dead. She hired me to find out if you... Yeah, if you sold her parrot, which you did, because you're a pile of crap, which is why we're down here. I have photos. You don't understand. That bird drove me crazy with its constant squawking. I, I didn't hurt the thing. I just found it a new home. Oh, well, now you're going to find a new home in the big house. Or pay a small fine and be on your way. Wait. So the murder investigation I was hearing about on the police scanner wasn't about me? Ooh, is that an OTR-160 band police scanner? Oh man, if I had one of those, I could get a leg up on the real crimes before they all get picked over. No more dumb, lame gigs involving fake crabs or goat statues or bird nappers. I could solve me a bona fide murder case. Hand it over or I'll... Oh. Ah! Oh, crap. That was an accident. Tell you what, uh, help me find that radio you just dropped and maybe we can work something out. Okay, yeah. 